Forex trade the news. What are the odds? Here is one of the videos used in the Forex ebook series Forex trade the news. What are the odds? Published in the Kindle Books department on Amazon. This ebook is the ninth in the series and documents three setups and trades conducted over the last two years along with charts and links to the YouTube videos. There are three videos illustrating the setup, progress, and results of the monthly release of the Canadian Net Change in Employment and Unemployment Rate Reports. Today's video represents the news report released on Friday, February 4, 2011 at 7 a.m. Eastern Time. This video is a presentation by the blog fundamentalforexblogging.com Here is my prelim setup for a trade starting with my market orders a sell order and behind it a buy order. Here are the units I am trading Here is my stop loss. The stop loss is important in cases of a spike reversal. Early on, my broker spread shown here is small, but may increase just before the news release, which will be shown later in this video. Next is my plan in case there is a surprise to the market. The plan tells me which action to take if the actual report is different from the forecast. Down here is my time. Here are my trigger points. I need to get the news report as soon as possible, so I use the Forex Factory's calendar. They have an actual pending button, which will give me the news report within a minute or two. By refreshing the calendar page, normally about four minutes before the report release, the green buttons will appear. With about a minute and 10 seconds before the news release, broker spread has increased to a negative dollar and 52 cents. And then again, about five seconds before the news release, broker spread has increased to a negative $2.03 and remains there until 40 seconds into the news release, when it drops back to a negative $1.52. It is now time to get the news release. I use the Forex Factory calendar, 
with the news release buttons, those green buttons in the calendar. At times, it takes a few clicks of the actual report buttons to get the report. This time it took only 16 seconds and two clicks to get the actual reports. In this case, the employment change was good, with an actual report of 69.2 thousand, higher than the forecast of 18.9 thousand by 50.3 thousand, and higher than the trigger point of 38.9 thousand by 30.3 thousand. The unemployment rate came out higher than forecast by 0.2 percent and was bad for the Canadian dollar. These two reports were in conflict. Anyway, I decided I will execute a sell of the British pound and buy the Canadian dollar. Broker spread is decreased back to a negative dollar and fifty two cents. There, I have entered my first trade for this report. There is my stop loss line. And I have now entered my second trade. There is my second stop loss line. The market is moving just as I hoped it would. There is some retrace which is expected. I exited the second trade about eight minutes into the report for a nice scalp win. I exited the first trade about nine minutes into the report for another scalp win.
Here is the chart. After the fourth minute, the market moved down well for five minutes, about 23 pips. Then it retraced back up for nine minutes, about 23 pips. Only then did the market have its best move down for about 31 minutes and 27 pips. The actual employment change report was favorable for the Canadian economy. However, unemployment rate was bad. These two reports were in conflict, but I decided to enter two trades anyway. My choice of currency pairs to trade was good. I was trading the currency pair British Pound versus the Canadian Dollar, and I had two small scalp wins. I started posting this news release on my blog in August 2009. This video is presented by the Fundamental Forex blog and has been presented in an ebook series titled Forex Trade the News What Are the Odds? published in the Amazon Kindle store under the title Trade Canadian Net Change in Employment and Unemployment Rate Reports. Click the link below this video to check out additional Forex ebooks I have published on Amazon. Thank you for watching this video and have a nice day.